kind of, um, my daughter, she really wanted a dog and she begged and begged. So finally we gave in. And we got this lovely dog who's part of a rehabilitation for dangerous dogs program. <laughs> uh, He's such a sweetheart, it's really hard to believe that there was ever a problem. Um, and we have to keep a logbook of his behaviour, but so far there are no issues. And I think they're a really much maligned breed, the Pitbull Terrier. <laughs> okay, um, this is my dog, let's make him feel welcome. Come on out. Hello! <laughs> so, um, is your leg gone round the wrong way, you're okay. Oh, I do love to perform, this is lovely. <laughs> Lovely old variety theatre. So, um, shall we start by telling everybody your name? Yes, it's Killer. <laughs> it doesn't suit him at all, but he doesn't answer to anything else. No, I'm a victim of class laws. So, um... <laughs> you okay? Slightly itchy, sorry. I've got fleas. Um, so, uh, what are you looking for? I've lost my bone. You've lost your bone? Where did you bury it? I didn't bury it. I didn't want to get my hands dirty. <laughs> what does it look like? Well, it's about this big. <laughs> okay, if things aren't that big, I do tend to drop them. All right, well, we'll keep an eye out. Joshy! Joshy! Joshy's killer's brother. Joshy! He's always looking for Joshy. I'll never stop looking for Joshy. Go skid. Thank you. So, um, shall we tell everybody your life story? Stop itching. Did you use the dyslexia? Yes, I did. Joshy! Joshy! Go skid. Thank you. Um, so, Killer started in a happy family home with children, D didn't you? Yes, from my brother Joshy. And then what happened? Tragedy struck. In what form? Divorce, I see. They couldn't resolve their differences, and they decided to split up the house. And you were listening at the door, weren't you, to see who was going to take which dog? Yes, I was listening like this. <laughs> and then simultaneously, they both chose Joshy. Oh, so sorry. Joshy! Joshy! Good, good. Thank you. So... What happened to you then? Well, I ran to the park with nothing but the wind to chase me. And what happened at the park? I hooked up with a homeless man. And we were very happy for a while. He had a lovely, distinctive smell. I could always find him. But uh, <laughs> things turned slightly sexual, so I had to move on. <laughs> Joshy! 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 Biscuit! Thank you. Right, uh, so you moved on from him. And is this when you went to the dog and duck? Oh, the dog and duck. Oh, what a quagmire. What was the dog and duck? Can you explain it? Well, it wasn't a sanctuary, believe me. It was a pub, yes, a tavern, a place where destitution and violence live on a diet of alcohol. And so what happened to you there? Is this where they were doing dog fighting? Yes, they were. I found myself in a cage with another dog, you see. And I said to him, I've really got no intention of fighting you. We're going to have to come to some agreement. And did you? Unfortunately not, so I killed him. <laughs> <laughs> Joshy! Joshy! Biscuit! Thank you. So, um, is this when you met Daryl? Oh, Daryl. Oh, yes, Daryl. Tell us about him. What was he like? A classic tough guy. He took me looting in the London riots. I see. <laughs> and much to the detriment of his street credibility, I dashed into Claire's accessories. <laughs> I got myself this lovely skirt. Well, it's very becoming. Well, thank you, thank you. Daryl didn't like it. He uh, didn't want to be seen dead with me, and I was alone again. Oh, it's a very hard life you've had. Yes, it was rough times, rough, rough times. <laughs> Fetch the decanter, I fancy a tinkle. No, you're going to have to wait. So, um, tell me, is this when we picked you up? Yes, sitting in a tutu on the King's Road. <laughs> right, uh, but things are... You're happy with us? Well, there are undisclosed tensions in her family, but she does her best to hide them. But what do you think it is with you, uh, you types of dogs? Is it nature or nurture that drives you? Well, you know, the, uh, nurture has its place. If someone like Daryl gets involved and he's going to kick you in the ribs. But there are instincts I can't rise above. What like? All right, now I really want to smell your crotch. Oh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Of all the crotches in the room, yours is the one calling out to me. <laughs> Just calling out to me, beckoning me with its aroma. Yes, get him on film. He's the one. He's the one. The one. Stop it. No, I just want a quick sniff, and then I'll get on with my life. It's not going to happen. You can relax. No, I wouldn't even enjoy it. It's just, you know, it's an instinct, that's all. Uh, and, and you, with your, with your colourful dress and your feet outstretched, if you don't move them, I will bite you. He won't bite you. I'll fucking nerve you! <laughs> Stop it! I'll fucking rip your fucking feet off! That's not going to happen! I'll fucking nerve you! Stop it! Stop it, killer. Killer? Calm down, calm down. I'm so sorry. I don't know what came over me. That's awful. Biscuit? No, no biscuit for you. Oh, fucking nerve you. Stop it. Stop it. Fucking watch you. Stop it. 
Okay, I'm so sorry, he's going to have to go. That's going in the logbook. We're not out of the woods yet. No, we're certainly not. Say goodnight. Goodnight, I'm so sorry. Coffee! Coffee!